Hello, I'm Rob Boss and welcome to the Shaper Series. Let's start out today with something simple. How about some feisty little mountains? You know the best way I find to explore the mountains is with an instigator. We're just using a two inch brush here. Maybe there's another little happy peak over here. It just kind of trails right off the page. I taught my son to paint mountains and guess what? Now he paints the best darn mountains in the world. Taper can really help a snow artist. Okay, now that we've got some nice mountains in our painting, let's go ahead and go in there and put in some nimble, quick, fun snapper wiggles. Maybe, oh, one lives right here. You just kind of wiggle it, and you wiggle it, and you wiggle it. You add as many wiggles as you'd like in your painting, or as few. You know, anybody can do what I do. Even you. It's all attainable. And now that we've got our mountains in there, we need somewhere to store our tools. How about a nice little shed? But this is your painting. You go ahead and make your shed whatever color you'd like it to be. Just like that. And you have to make those noises or it just won't work. After all, this is the Shaper series. How do you carve a beautiful feisty little turn? You know what? That's your challenge for the day. For mine, maybe mix a little of this blue, a little bit of that green color in there. Maybe you're just ripping along right there. Let's just blend this little rascal in there. And this is the hardest part of this method. Whew, that's just right. If you can do this, you can do anything. Now that's all there is to it. When your paintbrush is full of fusion rock or camber, it's easy to make a masterpiece. When we teach people to shape, this is the one they fall in love with. It works so well, and I think you'll fall in love with it too. Thanks for joining us today.